What's up, YouTube? I got that gameplay for you. Okay, guys, welcome to episode three of Back to the Basics. Um, this is for your mob traps, your your mob elevators. If you don't want to build a mob elevator, you just don't feel like doing all that, and you want to build yourself a crusher because hey, it's cool to have a crusher, right? Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> so let's uh let's fix that there. Okay, give me, give me, give me, give me. Okay. So um if you don't want to don't want to do all that you want to have yourself a crusher this is what we're going to do this is where your crusher is going to be at um just a little kill area you got to have somewhere for them to funnel funnel them in which is usually going to be from the top um you know just carry them 13 14 blocks 15 blocks away from the uh from the spawner all right uh just let your water stream tote them on down and then you can drop down another level if you want i just have this up here so the sun doesn't kill them whenever it gets daylight but um then you're gonna have yourself a, a sticky piston right there and a block underneath it so we're gonna put us a repeater right there anything that powers that repeater is gonna power this block which will power the piston okay so we are gonna come off this right here is gonna be your button all right this this is gonna go in Actually, no, it's not. What am I saying? This is ass backwards. This is going to come off the uh, the edge of blah, blah, over this way. Okay, we're not even there yet. You want to get where you want to put your button, okay? Um, we're just going to go over top of this. So we'll just do that right there. Come off one because we don't want the button to interfere with that redstone. So we're just going to go over the top, make ourselves a little bridge here. We're going to come out right here, we're going to make ourselves a block, another block, and then a string of three, okay? So you're going to put down three redstone, torch on your middle block, torch over here, and all this is is an RS Norlatch. Very simple, another torch on your third block. So there you go, that's what, it, that's what it's going to look like. Two torches there, one in the middle. So we're going to come off, and that is going to connect up to your piston. All right, this is what's going to time it. And then off of here, we are going to start with repeaters. You're going to need, let's see here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, and 23 repeaters with this last repeater on three ticks. Everything else is wide open on full ticks. This will bring zombie skeletons down to a one hit. All right, this is a lot of repeaters. Okay, so you got to have uh, quite a bit of resources. You got to have a lot of redstone, uh, a lot of smooth stone, and uh, of course some uh, some torches, redstone torches to make all these damn repeaters. So that is a lot. But this right here is actually kind of cool. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Let's get off of peaceful. We'll just throw a couple of you guys in there. Hit our button and crush away. Nice one hit. And there you go. Okay, I just had the water there so that they wouldn't die by the sun, but you would usually you would have this open. You would have this area and a little way down like right here you could smack their feet and then walk up and collect their goodies just you know without getting shot so we'll push this back we'll put some more water in there because the sun is about to come up now there is another way to do this um which is a, a bit of a newer way um so let's get rid of the repeaters um get rid of the water we are going to be using uh ethos hopper timer which I like very much, which I learned how to build in the uh, the Iron Trench videos back when uh, we was doing that on the server. So what we're going to do is, is you're going to place the hopper down. This is for PC guys. You know, this doesn't work on Xbox because Xbox does not have the hoppers yet. So then you want to shift walk right there and then shift again on the other side. You're going to put two hoppers together like that. Um, actually, I think I'm too close. So we'll do it over here down a little bit there we go and then off to the sides we need ourselves a comparator get rid of that button comparators coming out of the hoppers into a block pistons 
Stick your pistons. Where are you? There we go. We don't need the comparators no more. Whoops. We're going to go sticky piston, sticky piston, redstone behind the sticky pistons. And then you need a redstone block right there. Okay, now whenever you put items into this, this turns into a timer. All right. Oh, God. Frame rate. I don't know why I just dropped like that. Um, but these will shift from this hopper over to this hopper. And then once this fills up, it shifts back. And then it starts feeding into this hopper again. Okay, so what we can do here is put a block down. Put a torch on it. And put us a button down. That will stop this hopper from feeding back over it won't allow that torch won't allow this piston to push it over because this piston's being powered okay so what we can do here is flick it all right you activate the torch it allows it to push over they start feeding into this hopper which will eventually get full and then switch back over into this hopper and then it will be stuck again all right it's not going to let it push back over so let's see here what we can do is we are going to take a redstone signal and we are going to connect it up to our repeater over here. Don't want that torch messing with it. So we will go like that. That pushes over. Powers the redstone which powers our piston and it will crush for as long as you need it to. Now I think I think you need about 26 I think it's 26 um, so let's just take these oh let's take these out uh, okay we're gonna take these 18 19 20 22 3 12 5 and we'll start with 26 we'll see if that's enough let's get us some uh, some creatures up in here we'll go with zombies this time since we did skeletons last time Damn, they actually took damage right there. <laughs> so let's see, let's see if this kills them. Oh my goodness, way too close. God, it's killing my ears. I don't know if it's loud for y'all, but it is extremely loud for me. Okay, that killed them. They took damage. Let's put you right there. Let's see if you work. Oh, we gotta wait. Twenty-six in there. Okay. I think that might be a bit too much. We might have to lower that to 25, 24, somewhere in there. You just have to play with it to get your time right. Yeah. Okay, that looked like it was right on the money. So we need to take one of those out of there. So we'll just drop you in there and drop the rest down in there. Damn it! I keep making them get damaged, dude. Oh my god, I'm not going to sit here and do that. So, let's just get this sword out right here. There we go. Okay. Come on. Come on, buddy. So, this is a lot more... This is less resource intensive. Uh, oh, one, two hit. Okay, a two hit, and you add one more... It kill him so okay that's about as good as you're gonna get right there is the uh, 25 will bring them down to a two hit and should do the same for skellies actually and anything else you're gonna have to judge it uh, blazes are stronger of course um, and are really uh, spiders are a lot weaker so you wouldn't go as high with this but this is a lot less resource intensive all you need is to make the redstone block of course, two sticky pistons, um, the iron for the hoppers, of course, and uh, the comparators are pretty simple to make, so it's very easy. So anyone that has PC should actually already have most of this stuff, um, or should be doing most of this stuff anyway. But that's a nice little timer, but that is Etho's design. That's his timer. That's just a very awesome way, instead of using up, like, uh, what is this, 25, 26 repeaters? Like, that's a lot of repeaters to be using for... A crusher but either way it's they're still both very cool um and i like them both anyway but there you go there's two little crushers that you can use um 
this is what you're going to have to use on Xbox until you guys get updates to where you have the hopper. And on PC, you got your choice. Use either, either or. So they're both good, but hopefully you enjoyed this little episode. If you liked it, give it a like. If not, it's all good, but you know the deal. So peace and take it easy. Ah! Burn! Burn!